Okay, guys, the next challenge, the second challenge, every more go around the world in the counterclockwise direction once and stop at its starting position reborg must not step on the grass the correct path is shown by the dashed wide lines hint reborg carries some tokens you only need to use one hmm. what you need to know the functions move turn left and pull Oh, this is easy because we the hint token we have to use it right over here and we have the hint here stop at its starting position and after that we have the hint token meaning that the here is the token as you can see the smiley face we have to place it here and after that, make the loop. Either the test front is clear or wall in front, right is clear or wall on right. And object here. Let's open to the code. Okay, so go around the world. Okay, we have to. Let's open the flowchart as well. Okay, let me see. Have Rebor go around the world. So here we don't take notes. I just make the flowchart. Okay. We have to place the token. Put. Token. And after that, we just have to follow the front is clear. If front is clear or then again, wall in front. No, actually, I'll say if wall in front, then turn. Well, object here, how to use a while statement. It might be useful to know how to use the negation of a test, not in Python. Turn left. All right. Then we just move. Repeat sequence stop at token okay and now in the pseudocode we can make notes okay first of all place the token so while true
All right, conditions. Mm. I'll leave object here because token is a keyword, I think, here. And this one is another clue. So actually, I just want to see what happens. Okay. Boo. Yeah. 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 Now we'll take. All right. Perfect. So this one. So put the object. and move if front underscore is clear move again wall in front No, this will complete the test, but it will put, yeah, we don't want that. I just want one token. Okay, we just watched the robot now, guys. I think I did it. Oh, it will give me an error. Right over here. It should display an error. We don't move on the grass. Yeah, now it has to turn left. And after that... Yeah, we don't have to go in the grass. Okay. So, if, let's see, wall in front, and we have also right is clear. Wall on right. Yeah, there is no wall. We have to say right is clear. So if the front is clear, move. Also check if we have a wall in front. Turn left. Yeah, I can place an if statement here saying if right underscore is clear. Turn right. Mm -hmm -hmm. <laughs> I have to use the I think I have to make yes I will create another row Mm 
that is so left left so i have to turn one two three three times okay and i'll say here right is clear we have to activate rotating after that um no no okay let me see what happens here okay the test of the program will be here lessy one two and now let's see yes yes wall in front left yes sir wall in front in front it will be left again yes sir bomb and yeah this is it guys we've done it in my mind i can resolve this instantly but you know the thing is that you have i want to achieve the a skill of writing code so efficiently in my mind that let's say not so efficiently so i want to achieve the skill to resolve the code as fast as i have the solution in my mind you know what i'm saying i don't know maybe i'm talking i'm talking gibberish anyway around the world two is complete let's go to the third one